product that they were very proud of. And uh, just watching some various videos. Their uh, frozen custard. That is also a a really good seller, and they market it very well. It just looks very delicious. You turn around, get away from this one. There we go. And the standard uh, items: most fast food joints, French fries, which are crinkle cut. Very unique. Either you love them or you hate them. But I love them. I like I like any type of French fry because they're delicious. And uh, what fries do you like? I'm very interested. Comment on my Instagram or my Twitter. Uh, some unique note or noteworthy cultures that I've researched and covers was uh, they really pride themselves on giving a hometown hospitality, just being respectful and having good manners, saying please and thank you. That's a big thing that they took away from uh, being in a small town. We're starting off in a small town. The small town values are very, very good. It's just something that you don't learn in a big city. A lot of people just want the quick, super fast, super quick, but they don't really care for other people as much because they see so many people that they view people as like disposable. Okay, that thing is loud. I don't know. But yeah, Culver's is... Culver's is amazing. <laughs> From their website, they state that the uh, butter burger and... Butter, butter burger and fresh and frozen taste even better when they're served with a smile and a pleasing thing. So hospitality, after all, is something everybody at Culver's holds near and dear to their hearts. These qualities, the business, stems back to their founder, Ruth Culver, who just makes everybody, yeah, feel at home. I think I stated that earlier. <laughs> but yeah, all these po- all these little positive things add up to create a positive experience. And uh, yeah, Culver's is just, I want to eat there, man. <laughs> just reading their story and how they treat their employees, all their people. Yeah, I didn't even eat their food. I'm just looking at it. And they have their hearts in the right. Culver's definitely has their heart in the right path. And the customer who pays attention to these things, like I do, I can see that a business is bluffing or if a business keeps it real, Culver's are keeping it real. Just like your, like, just like your food. Just 100%. Midwest raised beef. <laughs> so yeah, Culver's keeps it real with their ingredients and their values. I'm impressed with this company. And stay tuned. Okay, stay tuned for uh, the point five episode where we talk about some of the business theory and some of the actual restaurant experience. Whew. Okay, that's a bit of a longer episode. The Savage shout out. Here we go. Uh, this is, I'll be shouting out uh, my bud, Craig and Olivia. Thanks for actually dining out at a Culver's and getting some cool pictures out there. I'll mention your experience a little more when we go to the analysis side, so the point five. But yeah, the pictures that you took to document your experience, that was clutch. That was so clutch. Thanks again. I'm going to eat at Culver's one day. (laughs) So, yeah, you can keep in touch with our social media pages. Facebook, Insta, YouTube, at Bike Buddy. Twitter, underscore bike. Let's get get Culver's to to listen to this. I want them to hear this. Uh, Feel free to give a suggestion on what you want to hear next. Give me some businesses, some, some other ideas. Yeah. Email me at uh, Albert Bird or A. Ellis at bikebuddy.com. Thanks again. I'll see you on the next episode.